What's up, we do KTV's movie review here, and today, you guys, we are here to review a third movie on the channel, and that movie is The Lion King, the live action remake to the 1994 original animation classic. Now, I want. So I went to go see this with Mac. Mac's in the background, and I'm at his house spending the night right now. So that's why I'm not in my like my usual spot for filming a video. This video is supposed to come out yesterday, but some changes for us going to go see the movie changed. So we ended up seeing it today. So that's why I'm doing the video today. So if you guys like, I'm not going to review it. I'm not even going to review the movie at all. Just talk about the some different things that were in this movie. Talk about. If I agree with the tomato, um, Rotten Tomato score, um, how I feel about the movie, and all of that is because the movie, and I'm about to start it, and before we get into it, spoiler alert, you guys have three seconds to click off the video, or if you guys just want to continue watching, you can go ahead and do that, three, two, one, there we go, now you guys are in the spoiler zone. I would have to say that The Lion King 2019 was a shot-for-shot shot remake. Basically, it took everything from the original opponent into its own in live-action form. Everything was the same except for a few things. Um, at the end of the 1994 movie, um, you do not see Rafiki. You don't see Rafiki um, uh, fighting against the hyenas and the lions. You end up seeing, you actually end up seeing him fighting the hyenas with a giant stick. And you also get to see Pumbaa and Timon fighting some of the hyenas. Now, I love this touch for the movie. It was amazing. And we, also, we didn't get any new songs. That's okay, because we got a lot more songs. We got, um, The Lion Sleeps Tonight. We got Hakuna Matata, Circle of Life. Um, Can You Feel the Love Tonight? Can't, I just can't wait to be king. Be prepared. And one piece of Be Our Guest. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and they did this. So, in the 1994 original, there was a scene to where Pumbaa and Timon distract the hyenas for Simba, Nala... Yeah, for Simba and Nala to walk in so they could dethrone Scar of the throne. What happened? In the original, they, were, they like got Pumbaa all dressed up like he was a luau pig. But in this one, it was better. We have Timon giving an accent, like a French accent, going, Wee oui, wee, oui, mademoiselle. And he's going, he's like, Wee oui, wee, oui, mademoiselle. And then, he's, then he says, We, now we kindly present your dinner. Be our guest. And he's going to say, Be our guest, like the song from Beauty and the Beast. And right when he says, Get the hyenas, look at him, they start running away, and the hyenas start chasing after him. And. Also, this movie had a lot more comedy than the original, so I liked it how it was. Uh, There's so. one part that was different. When Simba went to go eat those bugs, in the original movie, he's like, oh, this is gross, like that type of shit. No? Yeah. No, it didn't. Yeah. No. He went That's like this. That's how I remember it. What happened is that he slurped the worm. In the original, he slurped the worm, and he's like, He's like slimy yet satisfied, and then Simba did the same thing in this one, but he didn't make a face. He's like, he's like slimy yet well, satisfied. Can't really, because freaking yeah, because it's live action, and also the musical numbers. I have to say that the musical numbers in the old movie were ten times better, is because animation you could like in the new one. They don't, the elephants and giraffes, they don't lift up Simba when he's singing Just Can't Wait to Be King. They're just running around the whole time. Um, and Be Prepared. Be Prepared in 1994 was so much better than the one in 2019. The guy who sings Be Prepared, who plays Scar, doesn't even put emotion into it until the end. So where he finally goes, Be Prepared! When he finally goes like that, that's when it actually got good. But, um, so... Is that it? I think that's it. Oh, wait. Also, yeah, we're going to talk about some of the changes that I liked. Um, let me see. It was much longer. The original was like an hour and 24 minutes. This one was a runtime of 118 minutes, which is technically an hour and 58 minutes. But it was still pretty good. So, now we're going to see which one. Now, we're going to see... 
which one that we think is better. Mac, do you prefer Lion King, ni the Lion King 1994 or the Lion King 2019? 2019. He says 2019, and I have to say 2019 too. I like the Lion King 2019 better than the original. But you guys, now we're going to uh, see what we give the percentage of this movie. The original percentage of Rotten Tomatoes, they are out of their fucking mind because this movie was amazing. They gave The Lion King 58%. That's not even a good score. Mac, do you agree with that score? He says no. What would you give The Lion King 2019? 85. 85? Why is the other 15%? Um, well, they changed a little bit of it. Okay. I would have to give The Lion King 2019 about hmm, probably a 90%. And the 10% is that the old musical numbers in the 1994 were 10 times better. Like the vocals, like how they sing the music, is, besides Be Prepared, is better in the um, uh, new one. But how they like played it and the emotion they put into it and like how the movie showed it. Um, like, cause I just can't wait to be king. Simba is like on, like getting thrown up into the air by these elephants. That was good. So I have to give the Lion King 2019 a 90%. So you guys, that's it for today's movie review. I will be back with more videos about movie news, but I think the next time you guys will get a movie review is probably next week. And the movie it will be will either be 